So how can I shift my hyperbola around on the plane? How can I move it up and down or left and right? Well, we're going to use the same method we always use. x minus h plus k. So if I make both of those zero, so we can go back to our original. So this is the normal situation. Notice here I've gone plus k. This is the conventional way of writing it. But it is exactly the same as saying y minus k equals a over x minus h. So if I subtract for h a positive number, I move to the right. And if I subtract a negative number or add a positive, I move to the left. h is positive, h is negative. And the same for k. If k is positive, I move up. And if k is negative, I move down. k positive, k negative. Notice what happens to the asymptote. So if k is 1 and h is 3, whoops, I didn't want to do that h is 3 and k is 1, what now are my two asymptotes for this graph? They are in fact y equals k and, h, and sorry x equals h. Those are my two asymptotes, so as I move those around, that's where the asymptotes go. And that's true even if I change my scaling factor positive or negative. The h and the k, which when I'm at the original position, they were both zero, the h and the k tell me the asymptotes. So if I'm centered, it's just y equals a over x, then the asymptotes are y equals zero and x equals zero. But if I change h, I've changed my, my x equals h asymptote. And if I change k, I've changed my y equals k asymptote. 